It's not just a hot sauce, it's a way of life. Good lord, look at all the awards they've won. Here we go. Hi, I'm Bella and this is Dark. What's up? Welcome to Heat 101! Hi. <laughs> Welcome to the channel. Hey guys, welcome to Heat 101. Oh my god, don't, don't do that voice again. <laughs> hey guys, what's going on? It's Dark and I'm here with the lovely Bella. Hello. Welcome to Heat 101. Indeed. Today we have a sauce from Born to Hula. Born to Hula. <laughs> This is long and coming. It's been a really long time we've had this sauce. We actually have a couple different. We'll talk about that in a second. Um, but here it is, Born to Hula. This is the pumpkin hot sauce. Harvest. This is- The harvest edition. It's amazing. Look at the, the label on there. First of all, it's beautiful. It is. I want to restart part of that. Okay. That was bad. Yeah. <laughs> you keep talking over me. I'm, I'm going to punch you in the head. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> <laughs> nope. And this is Born to Hula's pumpkin hot sauce. This is the harvest. Oh, that label is so pretty. It really, like, it really gives you the essence of fall, doesn't it's, it? It's a great label. Has a matte finish. Um, love the graphics. Great company. Great people. Yes, we've I met love them a them. couple different times. <laughs> They're very down to earth, good people. I learned so much from them about their company and this hot sauce in particular when we saw them at Bowers this past year. Um, so this is actually a really special hot sauce. Yes, it is. This one being a harvest sauce, not a lot of companies do this. I can't think of, uh, maybe a few people do this, but this sauce is done differently every season, every harvest season every year yeah so we have the 2017 18 mm -hmm. and this is the 19. 19 and we are so far behind that we have been two years we're two years behind on this we have and what is really different about each of those is they slightly vary in in flavor because they use different peppers different peppers and and different growers and they they change things up a little bit so they're all different which is it's awesome listen I'm all about basic when it comes to pumpkin anything. I love PSLs, pumpkin spice lattes. I love anything pumpkin pie, Thanksgiving, just fall, autumn. It's my favorite, favorite season. And this sauce is so, 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 so intriguing to me. So just a little, a little shout out to Flavor and Fire. You can get this at Flavor and Fire. They're in Columbus. You can also get it online at Flavor and Fire mm -hmm. or uh, borntohula.com. Yep. www.borntohula.com. <laughs> I think there's a www, but it just says Born to Hula, so it'll be right here. I'm pretty sure the Some, goes sometimes saying they they can't get that one, so it's like um, instead of the www, it'll just be anyways. Is that right? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So this is season four. This is made with Detil. Ooh. Datil. 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 I had one of those. That's how I say it. I had one of those peppers. Harvest is the activity of reaping, gathering, and storing one's crops, usually ending with a celebration. This year's pepper, Datil, <laughs> was harvested by Reveal's Pepper Company. Revels. That's the one. <laughs> I think. Gosh. Revels Pepper Company. You sound just like me, so I'm bad at, at pronunciations too. It's Sorry, Revels, guys. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> If not, it's her fault. Uh, celebrate this festive time of year and enjoy our harvest and we shall. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize that it says on each year um, where the peppers came from. Yeah. That's so cool too. So I... this is season four and That's we awesome. have three and two. Pretty cool. Yeah. We should bust those out too, but. We should. At this I, point, I'm like, I don't want to get rid of wanna, them. I just want to hold on to them. Yeah, I just want to love them. We're kind of, you know, collectors too. We are. So, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if you oh. could tell. <laughs> All right, guys, let's take a look at those ingredients. We have pumpkin, number one ingredient, mm, so apple good. juice, light brown sugar, apple okay. cider vinegar, lemon juice, datil peppers, cinnamon, garlic, 
Sorry, there's no garlic? Where did that come from? Ginger, not oh, garlic. Oh, okay. Salt and nutmeg. All right. I'm so excited. I'm so, so, so excited. You guys, this is going to okay, be... Let's... I already know. This is going to be the perfect hot sauce for the Thanksgiving dinner table and for your Christmas dinner table. Well, Thanksgiving just happened, and we're we totally late on that. Better late um, than never. But here's our consistency. And there's leftovers still so happening. It's, it's very thick. If you can see that, how it's moving there. Very, the, very thick. I see all the spices there, too. Very thick stuff. Oh my gosh. I get a smell. smell I want to smell. <sighs> I know. I know. Oh my gosh. Wow. That's, it smells like pumpkin pie. That just makes just me pumpkin pie. So happy. Doesn't it? It really does. It just makes me so happy. I wish this season would never end. <laughs> Honestly, I really do. Well, I'm, we have like, it in obsessed. a bottle, so this should last us at least until the next batch comes out. I don't know, man. I'm like gonna, I, the first thing I'm gonna do is go put this on all the leftovers as soon as we're done. That's Smells great. Do. Here, why don't you go ahead and get your pour on? Okay. I have a feeling this is not going to come out very easily. Although, just a little shimmy here. <laughs> it's not, go oh, oh, I see something. Something's happening. Whoa. Let's see if I can't get it. Look, I just want to see if I could get it to stack up on here. Oh, look at that. Oh, <gasps> sorry. Four hours later. <laughs> there. <laughs> Two hours later. Sorry, honey. Oh, look, is it my turn? Look at my spoon. Look at it. There's a peak. And you've made a mess of the bottle and everything. It's okay. I'm just going to drink it. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh, that smells. That smells so delicious. Oh. Oh my gosh. I'm like, my mouth is watering. This stuff is like, you could just make a pumpkin pie out of just this. Here's your filling. Oh my gosh. Here's your filling. I just want to like, oh my God. It's amazing. Cheers. Curious about the heat. Oh my. Wow. Wow. That's where it's at. Wow is right. I got pumpkin pie just all day long. Okay. A slight pepper flavor to it. There is some beautiful heat. Yeah, it's happening. There really is, but it's like not overwhelming. Holding my spoon. It's perfect. Every single thing about this sauce is perfect. It's delicious. Great what, sauce. What would you put it on? Because I can apple name like pie. five things already. Uh, pumpkin pie, apple pie. Mm -hmm. I would do it on sweet potato pie. I would do it on sweet potatoes. Mm -hmm. I would dip uh, sweet potato fries in that. Or even just regular fries. Ice cream? Ice cream. Vanilla ice cream. Mm -hmm. Here's the thing though. I would put that all on top of my stuffing. I'm one of those weirdos. So there's some people that like things separate when it comes to their Thanksgiving and their Christmas plates, right? You want your food separate. I'm the type of person that I like to eat like my taters mixed with my um, <laughs> stuffing and then my sweet potato mixed a little bit with my stuffing and taters. So this I would put literally on anything. I'd put it on the turkey, I'd put it on the stuffing, I'd put it on the, on the, the taters. You could have just said this will go on everything. No, did I didn't want to say that because I wanted to make it I wanted to wanted break it down. Oh. Yes. I needed to break it down because the sauce deserves it because it's it's amazing. It's delicious. It is. It's a great sauce. I, like, that's not going to last long. I'm it's a dessert. A dessert. <laughs> Whatever a dessert. <laughs> it's a dessert sauce. It, it's a definitely it a dessert sure sauce. Is, honey. And <laughs> I could see even putting this on pizza. Uh, I, I, love I would pumpkin. do maybe new. Maybe. Maybe noodles. noodles. Maybe. I don't know. If I'm fearing, if you're fearing. <laughs> if you're fearing. If I'm you, fearing you. If I, if, if I fear for my if, life, if I'll I'm put it on the noodles. Feeling daring. <laughs> not fearing. <laughs> All right. So head on over to. The, good lord. Mm. All right, guys. So head over to borntohula.com. 
check them out. Great sauce. This is amazing. Very few sauces that say they're dessert sauces or give that impression that they're dessert sauces actually are. Mm -hmm. And I'm really impressed because this is just, it's a phenomenal sauce. It's not what you would expect out of a hot sauce. No, it's it truly is an autumn. It's a fall, mm. beautiful, so good, pumpkiny, delicious, sweet, uh, with some good heat, hot sauce. It really is, and it's it's phenomenal. Like I can't even say enough about this. I I love it. I love it. Great stuff, guys. I, you could just eat it by itself. To Congratulations, be Born Hula, because this is a winner. This is money right here. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you guys need to check this out. This is super unique and. We're gonna need more for sure. Definitely. And it's and it's new every year. There's new peppers. It changes. The yeah, that's great. Changes. That's so cool. Something to look forward to every year. Yeah, they support all these different you know growers and stuff too with using different peppers. So I think that's amazing. It's all about the community. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out with us. We love you guys. Thanks for all your awesome support. We're gonna keep putting out videos because you guys keep watching. So thank you very much for all your support. Yes. Hope everybody out there has a fantastic day. Don't be afraid to get your born to hula going on. Do it. Thank you.